Hi everybody, it's Julie and we are going to make our nine clusters. I have this eight and a half by 11 digital and um, <laughs> the way that I'm doing my video, my um, journal this time, one of them would get cut off. So I'm going to go ahead and use this as my base for my um, clusters and I'm going to start by adding some of the neutral coffee dyed parchment paper. Okay, so we'll be adding, I'm gonna be making nine clusters that are all the same or similar. Okay, so there's three. There's that one, there's that one. Okay, there's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, and I, you know what? I want to use this also neutral. And um, I have a bunch of it hanging around. So let's see, I might have to grab some, I might have to tear these in half. That's okay, we can do that. And we'll take the edge off of this one. Okay. So we have parchment paper. We need one more. One more. Well, if we can find a bigger piece, that will be better. But we can use that. Okay. Um, so I want to use... Um, I'm using up my stuff. So this is from the Friday Freebie. So I've got four embellishments left on here. Okay. And I am just ripping them. So the Friday freebie, we had that at our Friday fun day last, fr last Friday. You can go and watch that video and find out the details on how you can get your own um, Friday freebie uh, goodies to be able to use. Um, okay, I've used all my tickets so let's go ahead and we're gonna get into the box we need six more six more did I get all there must be one more yep <laughs> okay okay so you're you're um bottom part on this this is one of the requirements for the nothing but in junk journal challenge and um, you were to use an eight and a half by 11 to 12 by 12 paper of whatever you wanted underneath okay so here I have another I have another circle I think that'll be good with the holly up there and here I have best Christmas wishes, maybe with the Santa. These are little postcards that I have. There's another Santa. some more words. I've got hollies. And you know what? I think we should do 
and do that. These are my favorite, actually. We'll do, we'll do three of these, okay? And let's see, we'll add Santa on one. Santa and the kids on one. Oh, you know what? We'll go with this one. Kind of like that one with that. Okay. Okay, so we're going to use those things. And then I might want to add like a piece. I've got some hollies. Okay, so they are, they are digital. Um... I have some safety pins. Oh, I did. I got one. So I might add a safety pin. I could add the bigger safety pins. I've got the bigger ones. Okay. So we could do those. <clears throat> and I do have okay. I also have from the paper pad I have some of these candy canes that we can go ahead and rip and add. Okay, so like that one might like look good with a candy cane. That one. Okay, so you just have to have at least three different things on top of your base for your cluster. So this is paper pad that I'm adding here. And we're good. We got our parchment paper. We've got a digital. And we've got the, the tape. So we don't even need to add the these extra. But you know what? I've got them. <laughs> so I think we might as well use them. Okay. to this one okay now we've got that piece left still okay now I can also add a number which I think might be kind of cool so one two since I don't have any tickets out here Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Okay. Okay. So now we're going to go ahead and start putting them down. And we'll see if we need to, what else we might want to add. Okay. So for this one, I'm going to start right here. And I'm just going to put that down. Then I'm going to put this a little puddle on top, puddle on bottom. And for this, I'm going to go ahead and put my, my glue on the back of it. Okay, now I need to see this. So I'm going to pull that over. Okay. And then my candy cane. Just got to decide how I want. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and try and rip this edge of my candy cane. Okay. 
Okay, that worked. And we'll just put the candy cane down there at the bottom. Okay. Do we want a do we want a holly on here? I don't think that one needs a holly. Okay. So there's our first one. Put this in the center. And figure out what we want to see. We want to see the holly. <laughs> Excuse me, maybe that berry from underneath. Okay. Come over and oh, maybe maybe no berry. I like that. Okay. So have you um, made clusters on top of on top of a paper before? Besides for a Dear Julie Julie challenge. We're going to also be putting the number on here. Yeah, the number is going to make quite the difference. Let's do this one before I end up with it. Okay, yeah, so just filling it in, we'll go ahead and since that's what I'm doing, I'll go ahead and fast forward it for you. Okay, so one, two, three, six, nine, all on my one background paper. So what I'll do is I'll just go ahead and I will rip around those spots. Okay. Um, you can cut around them however you want to do it. But the other thing is, is I do want to add my, um, my number. And I think I'm going to do that with a staple. Okay. So I'm going to staple my number on. Okay, so we'll go around and staple a number onto each one. It will also help to hold the, the thing together. I could have glued it, and I, um, I should have had my... You know what? Let's see the tiny attacher. If I, I did get I did get tiny attacher staples, so um, that's that's uh, 
yeah so let's go ahead and we'll refill it They had them at Joann's, which is cool because at Joann's, I was able to get them on sale. So a better price than, actually a better price than Amazon, so for this time. Sometimes I've had to order them from Amazon because I needed them and they were not on sale and I was like, and I, I need them. I need them. <laughs> okay, so Tiny Attacher is going to be much better for this size. I think we'll use um, two staples because to me that looks like it's on purpose. We'll just go around and stay staple our numbers on there these were from a little tape measure that I had that I had it for several years in my purse and it um, it stopped working it the I had it so that if I was like at a yard sale or I was at a store and I needed to measure something um, I would have it and unfortunately, it stopped. It stopped going in and out. So it was a retractable one. That's the word I was looking for. And it stopped retracting. So, and staples count as one of your three things. So if you're stapling something on to your clusters, that, that counts. Okay. So there we go. And so what I will be doing, I'll go ahead and take one off and show you. I will go ahead and be able to... Rip this, sure. Okay. Okay, so I can rip that. I can continue to rip it, but it is ready to go in my journal. I have my nine clusters that are attached to my eight and a half by 11 sheet. And um, yeah, I'm really excited. Now, I think. That there's a possibility when these get put onto um, where they're going, I may go ahead and, like, this one has the holly, and I may go ahead and add the three, three for the holly, or, you know, I like to do the dot, 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 and this is one of the things that I've added to my, um, to my, uh, kit is the bling. The other thing is, is I have several of these. And so I can go ahead and go around and give each of these their, their glitter from the fingernail polish. Okay. And then on these, maybe give Santa, Santa's tree the holly just so each one has a little bit of the glitter it looks totally retro to me when they have the glitter on them so we'll come and glitter around this one where the greenery is okay and
she's got holly greenery right there. Okay. Okay. So that is what um, I'm doing for my, my nine clusters. And so all I have left to do is my tassel. And so we'll come back and we'll do that. And don't forget on Friday, we will have our freebie Friday fun day. So watch for the freebie to go up and um, you can find more information about where the freebie goes up in last Friday's freebie Friday fun day video and see how things work. We will be doing the do the thing drawing. We will be doing, um, we have other um, fun giveaways during the uh, live so it will be live on Friday. And don't forget on my birthday on Monday, November 20th, we will have our design team uh, reveal for the month of November as well as um, a party. Okay, so looking forward to seeing you there. Find something to celebrate every day. Thank you so much for being here. And don't forget that thumbs up. Please don't forget that thumbs up. And also, don't forget to go watch another video after this one so that uh, YouTube knows that I've kept you on YouTube because they like that. Have an amazing day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye-bye.